Well, it's April 1st and we're celebrating Joy's birthday. We got Winnie the Pooh here. And here we have Cookie Monster. Now, cook He's got his cookies. Hey, Daniel. Hi, Nana. You can't do it all. There's the cowgirl. <laughs> hey, Jamie. No, I want you in the picture. Jamie. Okay. Oh, here they come. The Gladwin swimming team. Good to see you. Yeah, I know. <laughs> uh, just against a fireplace. That'd be great. Hello, Joseph. How are you? Good to see you. Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> My hand's going on now. <laughs> hey, Ben, I'm going to come in and say hello to you so you can be on the video, okay? Ooh. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Kathy Nifel, let's get this on film. Let's get this on film. How are you? Hi. Hi. Good to see you. Well, let's get a little closer. Why, it's Mr. Schwartz. This is Gigi. Hi, hi, hi. I like your uh, cowboy hat. Well, there's one right up at the door for you okay. and Mandanas. That's Cookie Monster. Oh, that's right. Cookie <laughs> And what character is this? Oh, it's Andrew Lincoln. I love Cookie Monster. That's not Cookie Monster. That's Elmo. That's Elmo. This is Cookie Monster. Great costume. I don't know who this is. Hi, Pam. Hi. Hi, Elmo. There's the birthday girl. There's the birthday girl. Elmo's here. Hi, Joy. Cookie Monster. Cookie Monster. Winnie the Pooh's over here, Joy. You see Winnie the Pooh? So Winnie the Pooh went out, maybe Winnie the Pooh went outside for a minute. <laughs> Do you know that? Do you huh? know this? Smile, Joy. Mwah. Happy birthday. <laughs> hey, Isabel. Hey, over here. Hey, Joy. There's Isabel and Joy. Yeah. <laughs> Who's going on the horses? I think the biggest one doesn't want to do it. Melissa, does not Melissa doesn't want to go on the horse. Is she going to go on? Oh, let's take a picture though. Hold on a second. Let me get a picture. Come back here. We're shorter. Where is it? Okay, hey. There you go. Look at it. Okay, let's get your head up. Hold on, hold on, hold on.
You might have to mow the yard now. Wait, 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 just a second. Just a second. Is that how you got started? That's a small little horse. Let me, let me get over here. Excuse me, can I get over here? Oh, uh, uh, you don't want to do this. You don't want to claw me, huh? He wants to eat the grass. <laughs> Jill, could you do it in front so it comes straight on? <laughs> there you go. Okay. Yeah, we're going to do vertical straight on. You can get the horse in there. Am I the proper distance? Are you yeah. the horse in? Yes, you're fine. The horse isn't smiling. Is that okay? That's fine. <laughs> Joy's going for a ride. Come on, Joy, Joy. Pill will be back. Pill will be back. Oh. It's okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, uh, where's where's Pooh? Pooh? Just, just let her go to Pooh. Okay. okay. Go ahead. Go ahead to Pooh. She's having a little trouble in there. Those boots are a little big. Okay, why don't you put another? I just wanted to put a Okay. You want to play with Pooh rather than the Come horse. On, let's, 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 let's take, put your shoes on now. They're, they're big. Hey, Jordan. Hey, Fuzzy. Hey, man. How you doing? Give me five. Oh, there we go. There we go. Hey, Jordan. There's your cow girlfriend. Oh, do we got a picture of him? Yeah. Okay. Hold on. Are you going to ride the horse? Good. Even though you don't want to. Okay. You're doing it for who? Your dad or your mom? Okay. <laughs> Her cousin had a, a birthday about a year ago. Uh huh. Where's Elmo at? Bye. How old's Joy? Elmo might have to sleep over tonight. Hello, how old is Joy? How old is Joy? Joy, how old is Joy? Hey, Isabel, you want to go over and say hi to Elmo? Say bye, 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 Isabel, say hi to Elmo. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead. Can you hug Elmo? <laughs> Good girl. <laughs> Daniel, whose lap are you sitting on? Whose lap? Who are you sitting on? Is it Winnie the Pooh? What other characters are here? What are their names? Who else did you see here today? Elmo and who else? Cookie Monster? Yeah, okay. I just want to make sure I got them all. I didn't want to miss one of them, okay? Want to wave bye bye and wish Joy a happy birthday? This is on the video. Want to say happy birthday to Joy? Be on the TV later. Go ahead. Say happy birthday, Joy. I guess not today. <laughs> She's right here. Happy birthday, Joy. There you go. Looks like Rosalie's waiting in line to go on the horse. Oh, <laughs> that must be the reason. What? Susie, wave. Everybody's here. We got a big crowd. Hi. Hi. This may be the last video before the birth. Hello. Happy birthday, Julie. I gotta get a profile shot.
There we go. Because every time I see you, you have a smaller camera. There you go. Size matters. Look at this. Very helpful. Very helpful. Help. How about if I do this? I can keep off. So other than the fact that Mary has to do more jobs, I don't have any help. Did you figure it out? <laughs> there you go. Can we get a picture? Hello. Do you have fun on the horses? You're not talking, huh? <laughs> hey, Jeremy. Hey, cowboy. Hey, cowgirl. Kira. Kira. Daniel. Hi. You look like a babushka there. Okay, all you gotta do is just hold it and look at us. There you go. Joanne's taking your picture. Uh, good girl, happy birthday. Good girl. Happy birthday. Good, girl. Hey. good luck. Did you take good? <laughs> Thank you. 
bag. Yeah. Hi, Mommy. Did she say some of those clothes were too big? Hey, Joy. Like she had veins all over her body. Yes. It's all black marks up and down from here to the bottom. Let's pass over year 2001. Mark's occupying the computer. Pop Up's occupying Joy. There's Barry. And all the tables are set. We're going to go outside in just a second to start. It's time for Joy. Joy. Joy, can you say it's time for Passover? Say it's time for Passover. Can you say it? Okay, go sit with Joshi. Go ahead. Okay. Okay, Harriet, I'm going to give you a special part today. Harriet? Okay. Jamie, saying grace? Salma, just want to just get your smile on here. Okay, I'm gonna get everybody on here. I'm easy, I mean. It'll take me about two seconds. It's amazing how guys can do that. I don't know. But like Mike, I get it all ready and have it all fun. Jonathan. You know, I Emily. All that prep talk. Hey Sarah. Hey Steffi. Okay. Well, you can uh, shoot highlights if you want. Okay, can I have everyone's attention? 
Does that you know what was going on there? Or, yeah. Okay. Thanks, Michelle. That's well, helpful. Uh, thank everybody for coming today. And um, we made up this little booklet a couple of years ago. Um, many of the people were here then or here today, and a couple of others as well. And uh, just so everyone understands, the purpose behind the Seder is to retell the story of Passover. And that's what we're going to be doing today. And it's a kind of a, a little storytelling and a, a little bit of rituals that you go through. And then we have a really uh, terrific meal that a lot of people have all contributed to. So um, basically, the story of Passover is about the exodus from Egypt. No, you got Joyce walking around with a banana in her mouth and a young. OK? Now, we left, we left the northern part of Africa. Okay, uh, and the story of Passover is basically told through Haggadah, and the Haggadah is basically normally one of those things that you get from Manischewitz, but we've sort of created our own right now. And on this first page, you'll notice that there are 14 different things, and Barbara has asked us to make sure that we do all of them in detail. <laughs> we'll do that tonight, uh, well, so that we get a complete save. Okay. The first thing that we want to do, though, is we want to light the candles. Sam, you better keep your eye on me. They said, I was on the internet, they said that the new thing is to have the kids hide it from the parents. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Now, this is the matzah, okay? The bread of suffering. Okay. Um, Randy, you want to read the part about the matzah where it starts saying, See the bread of suffering? See the bread of suffering which our ancestors ate in Egypt. All you who are hungry, come and eat with us. All you who are in need, come and celebrate the Passover with us. This year we are here. May next year find us in the land of Israel. This year we are enslaved. May next year see us free. Okay. Uh, Steve, you want to read the next section about the matzah? This matzah is set aside as a symbol of hope for those Jews who are not free. They are not free to celebrate the Pesach with joy. They are not free to express their delight in the season of growth and rebirth. They are not free to teach the story of Pesach to their children as Adonai commands us to do. We pray for healing and peace, one for now and one for always. They have not been forgiven. Okay. Um, Selma, you want to read the next paragraph? May the... It starts the... It's on... Right here. The source of strength be blessed for once before us. Help us find the courage and let us say amen. Amen. And, and Rosalie, you want to read the next one, the next section? And bless those in need of healing, the renewal of body, the renewal of spirit, and let us say amen. 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 Okay. Now we come to the four questions. Okay? So who's up is the four questions, uh, people? I think the youngest four... four oh, it, it says four. It's a typo. It's a confusing, it's really that's really one. one. It's real, you, you actually understood it very well because it was wrong. First question. Okay, say it loud so everyone can hear you. On all nights, we may eat bread or matzah. On this night, why do we eat only matzah? Okay, and, and uh, Staffy? I'm going to give you some no, right now you're eating. If you, if you want to eat, you can do it. Okay. Um, on all other nights, we may eat any kind of vegetable. On this night, we must wait. On this night, we have why? to wait. What? This night, we have to wait. <laughs> wait, no, no, hold on. On this on, night, we must what? On this night, we must taste bitter greens. Okay. All right. Then the third question in English is by uh, Jonathan Alper. On all other nights we do not have to dip vegetables even once. On this night, why do we dip them twice? The greens in salt water and the bitter in cherries. 
Okay, Harosis. Okay, and then Sam? Okay, now. Um, yeah. Johnny? Go over with your brother. Because they did it together. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Okay, now we're going to have the four questions in Hebrew by a, a tandem of helper and helper. Okay? You getting the chats, man? The chats? Okay, so you ready, guys? You're going to do it together. Ready? When Johnny's ready. You ready, Jonathan? Do you know oh, where it is? Page here. It's here, Jonathan. It's right, right here on the page. Turn it back. I got it for him. Okay? It's Manish Tanoff, right? Okay, go ahead. Sam, you want to start him? I'm going to go. Manish Tanoff. Manish Tanoff. Manish Tanoff. Manish Tanoff. Agreed. Miriam ran to fetch Yahavad, who thereby able to raise her child and teach him about his history. When the for beating a Hebrew slave and was forced to flee Egypt, he went to the land of Midian, where he met and married the lovely Zipporah. He became a shepherd. One day, as he was tending his flock, a marvelous sight appeared to him. It was a miraculous bush that burned and burned but not consumed. God was appearing to Moses in the form of this bush. Moses heard God's voice call him, saying, I am the God of your ancestors. 
I have heard the suffering of your people. I have seen their oppression. I am ready to take them out of Egypt to a land flowing with milk and honey. God assigned to Moses the task of freeing the Hebrews from their bondage. God told Moses to return to Egypt to tell the Israelites of their impending freedom and instructed Moses to warn Pharaoh that the ten terrible plagues would rain down upon the land of Egypt if he did not comply with God's command. <coughs> Moses was a poor speaker and nobody of importance, so it worried him to be responsible for such an important task. But God insisted and assured Moses, I will be with you. Moses set out for Egypt. Okay, so this is where the, the story about the ten plagues come in. Okay, and we're just going to briefly go over what the ten plagues are. Michelle, you want to just read us the ten plagues so everyone can hear them, and then we're going to go on to the Seder plate. Yeah, here we're going to do it. You want to do this? Yeah. Blood. Everybody well, actually, it? each person should write. Each if you, for each plate, take a drop of blood from your wine glass and just touch it and put it on your plate. We didn't put any blood in the wine glass. It's for real, did we? Read together. Blood. Yeah. Blood. Okay. Frog. Frog. Lice, peace, cattle disease, foils, hails, locusts, darkness, slaying of the firstborn. Okay. The last, the last plague, by the way. This actually, this might even be a sister routine. Now, Dianu. 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 It would have been enough. It would have been enough. One Rothstein girl would have been enough, but no, we got two. Dianu. Dianu. <laughs> okay. Here, Jamie. Here. You got it? Okay. So Jamie's going to start in, no, in Hebrew. Dianu. <laughs> Dianu. Dianu. Okay, now we got hot guy y'all. Is this is this Harriet did read this last time? But I don't. But I but I it was just so funny when Harriet did it. But um but actually I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna have Andre do it. Okay, Andre. Andre doesn't know Hebrew. Okay, Stuart says hot guy y'all. Okay, I want you to do the first three paragraphs. That beat the dog, that bit the cat, that ate the kid. 
My father bought the Tuzum. Agadya, Agadya. Then came the butcher and slew the ox that drank the water, that quenched the fire, that burned the stick, that beat the dog, that bit the cat, that ate the kid. My father bought for two zuzum. Okay, Taurus. Wanna do the next one for us? <coughs>
and we're only down to six bottles. <laughs> I mean, literally, that's what we have. We have to go so much she had a she had a cookie there. <laughs> We're having a man on the street interview. How are we enjoying this year's Seder? Two thumbs up. Thumbs up? Thank you. You had it. You heard it here first. The woman on the street interview. Thank you. 